you up to date. Go away. Thank you. I can get rid of that one. And that one. And that one. Uh, get rid of that one. And these two. There. Now everyone here equip their bests. Tolly. She what does she use? Oh yeah, these. Okay. There. I won't have to do that again at least. Again. Come on. Yeah, maybe I should split this set in two if it's gonna be like an hour over time. It's gonna be an hour and a half over time, I'm gonna split it in two sets, obviously. Because otherwise it'd be kinda stupid, won't it? I was going to shoot that guy. Oh my god, I can't shoot, I've got overheat. Oh fuck. Dolly, yeah, put your face in front of my gun, that'll work out for you. Idiot. Now I have to wait until I can use my medical of the way just in case because it killed me last time after it was dead. All clear. How many um hundred forty four items. Okay I saw my mouse there for a second. That was weird. Oh. 
they're glowing. Okay, are we moving or... Yes, we are. Couldn't see there for a second. Oh my god, I'm gonna have too many items. Yeah, I already have. Yeah, there. I don't need these incendiary rounds. And take the shredder rounds as well. Okay, yes. There are not. Do you have a good. Yeah, you have the best already. Anything less than 50 damage will have to go. 150, I mean, obviously. Actually, this one's better. Take that one. Oh, that one can go as well. Terminator. Oh, that one. Avenger can go. That Avenger can go. Terminator can go. So sorry, guys, for this. <laughs> this is kind of boring, I know. Definitely have enough, uh, what's it called? Omnigel? Why do you not have the, your thingy equipped? I'm fairly certain I did this for you already. Because I gave you your, um... Where are they? No, no cryo rounds. Radioactive rounds. No, I gave you these, uh. whatever. Just pick something. <sighs> there. There. No, I got some more metagel. <laughs> That's it. We need to clear the gap and set those charges. Negative contacts, Commander. Good. I think we're almost done. I mean, there's a bit of boss set. fight. Everyone bunker down. Bunker down. Boss fight area, if I've ever seen one. Okay, those are the charges over there. All oh, right, nice work. That's one less thing to worry about. Commander, I'm bringing us in. I'll get as close to the site as I can. No. There's Normandy. Um. That's a nuke. Oh my god, I must be so nervous carrying that. Hug? No. Bomb is in position. We're all set here. Commander, do you read me? The nuke is almost ready, Lieutenant. Get to the rendezvous point. Negative, Commander. The Geth have us pinned down on the AA tower. We've taken heavy casualties. We'll never make the rendezvous point in time. Get them out of there, Joker, now! Negative. It's too hot. You can't risk it. We'll hold them off as long as we... It's okay, Commander. I need a couple of minutes to finish arming the nuke. Go get them and meet me back here. Up to the AA tower, move! <laughs> Up to the AA tower, move, and then like, standing still. I like this team that we have here going on. Tali and uh, Rex. Where do I go? That doesn't sound good. Oh no, it's Normandy. Um.
actually going... Oh my god. Where do I keep getting this equipment from? Where's my armor that I'm wearing? Actually, there's better armor already. No, there's not. No, no, no. Um, do I have a better one? I have two regeneration. It's called first aid interference. Interface. Do I have a better one? Yeah, I have better shield recovery, but... No. No better one. Um, I'll be looking for that. If I ever go shopping, that's the first thing I'll be looking for, because that's really useful. <laughs> I'm trying to wait until I can get my first aid up. But I want to keep going at the same time. No elevator music. Quite. Too quiet. Okay. More crap. Woohoo. I can carry five more items. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, for sending in reinforcements. Chief, we just spotted a troop ship inbound to your location. It's already here, and it's bleeding Geth all over the bomb site. Can you hold them off? There's too many! I don't think we can hold them! I'm activating the nuke! What are you doing, Chief? Making sure this bomb goes off, no matter what! It's done, Commander. Go get the Lieutenant and get the hell out of here! Belay that! We can handle ourselves! Go back and get Williams! So yeah, people! Choice! Getting Caden or getting Ashley? Fuck that, we're getting Williams. Ashley! <laughs> Radio Joker and tell him to meet us at the bomb site. Oh, I brought him. Yes, Commander. I. It's the right choice, and you know it, Ash. I'm sorry, Caden. I had to make a choice. I understand, Commander. I don't regret a thing. <laughs> and we go back. Yeah, some of you might have preferred Caden. I never really liked Caden. Come. On. So, I didn't like his eyebrows. I prefer Ashley. Okay, we're gonna have to fight there, I, pres I presume. Dead. But what if they had bowed before the invaders? Would the 
Protheans still exist? Is submission not preferable to extinction? Do you really believe the Reapers will let us live? Now you see why I never came forward with this to the Council. We organics are driven by emotion instead of logic. We will fight even when we know we cannot win. But if we work with the Reapers, if we make ourselves no, useful, because they're gonna kill think us how anyway. many lives can be spared. Once I understood this, I joined Sovereign. Though I was aware of the dangers, I had hoped this facility could protect me. You're afraid Sovereign is influencing you. You're afraid he's controlling your thoughts. I've studied the effects of indoctrination. The more control Sovereign exerts, the less capable the subject becomes. That is my saving grace. The Sovereign needs me to find the conduit. You're just in the dark my mind is still rest. my own. For now. But the transformation from ally to servant can be subtle. I will not let it happen to me. Sovereign's manipulating you and you don't even know it. You're already under its power. No, Sovereign needs me. Jeez. If I find the conduit, I've been promised a reprieve from the inevitable. This is my only hope. Together, we can stop Sovereign. We don't have to submit to the Reapers. We can beat them. I no longer believe that, Shepard. Visions cannot be denied. The Reapers are too powerful. The only hope of survival is to join with them. Sovereign is a machine. It thinks like a machine. If I can prove my value, I become a resource worth maintaining. There is no other logical conclusion. You were a specter. You were sworn to defend the galaxy. Then you broke that vow to save yourself. I'm not doing this for myself. Don't you see? Sovereign will succeed. It is inevitable. My way. Is the only way any of us will no, survive. Okay. I'm forging an alliance between us and the Reapers, between organics and machines, and in doing so, I will save more lives than have ever existed. But you would undo my work. You would do our entire civilization to complete annihilation. And for that, you must die. Okay, that's great. Oh, I can't move. Okay. Keep working there, Ashley. Where the fuck am I? I don't get anywhere near fuel tanks. Is that really all he's gonna do? And uh, either um, Caden or um, Ashley. But thankfully, we only lost one. Hey, I can't believe Caden didn't make it. How could we just leave him down there? Olenko knew the risks going in. He gave his life to save the rest of us. It should have been me, Commander. You know that. It wasn't your call, Williams. I had to choose. I chose you. I'm... I'm sorry, Commander. You saved my life. I'm grateful for that. You have like a sister and stuff. He me. didn't have that. So Alenko I mean... was a superior officer. I would have gladly stayed behind. 
It wasn't your fault. It wasn't my fault. The only one to blame here is Saren. Yes, sir. I'm... We'll get it done. Commander, excuse me for interrupting, but I have an idea. I think the beacon you, you found in Saren's base was similar to the one you found on Eden Prime. It may have filled in the missing pieces of your vision. I might be able yep. to help you put all those pieces together. Mind rape. You want to join our minds again, don't you? Okay, go ahead. Relax, Commander. Embrace eternity! I never thought the images would be so intense. It's the same thing last time. I need a moment to collect myself. Did the vision make any sense to you? It's a distress call. A message sent out across the Prothean Empire. A warning against the Reapers, but the warning came too late. What about the conduit? There were other images, locations, places I recognized from my research. Ilos! The conduit is on Ilos! I've never heard that name before. I am not surprised. Ilos is in a region of space accessible only through the Mu Relay, but the Mu Relay was lost <laughs> thousands of years ago. Nobody knows where it is. How do you lose a mass relay? Its original coordinates would place it deep inside the Terminus systems. Unfortunately, a star in one of those nearby systems went nova roughly 4,000 years ago. The shockwave sent the relay trillions of kilometers off course. Then the dust and the radiation from the exploding star engulfed that entire region in a dense nebula cloud. Finding any object in space is difficult. Finding the Mu Relay inside a nebula cloud is virtually impossible. It would take I'm decades. I'm guessing we will be able to find it. Are you saying it's hopeless? I am afraid so. Unless you somehow find the coordinates for the Mu Relay, then it would be possible to... Oh. I am sorry. The joining is... exhausting. I should go to the medical bay and lie down yeah, for a while. Yeah, I knew Dr. Shockwash should, this should exactly take a look at you. Same. That will not be necessary. Yeah. I just need some We're rest. done here. Dismissed. Commander, there's a combo nearby. I can link us in if you want to report back to the Citadel Council. You know, to warn them about Sovereign. Okay. Set the link up, Joker. They need to know. Patching it through. Commander Shepard, I'm pleased to see your mission on Vermeer was a success. Oh, success? Saren is formidable enough without an army of Krogan serving under him. The Krogan would have served Sovereign, a Reaper. Yes, we saw mention of this on your report. Sovereign, a sentient machine, a true artificial intelligence. This news is quite alarming, if it turns out to be accurate. Sovereign's a Reaper. Saren admitted it. He's playing you, Shepard. Oh my god, I spoke Saren to it! Saren still has contacts on the Citadel. He probably saw your earlier reports, the ones talking about your vision and the Reapers. It's highly possible Saren is using false information to throw you off balance. Our own intelligence has never turned up any corroborating information. Sooner or later, you're gonna have to take something I say on faith, Counselor. Try to see this from our perspective, Commander. Saren is a threat we can recognize. However, as far as we know, the Reapers only exist in your visions. But the people on my ship saw Our me talking to it. trillions of lives. We cannot act on the accusations of a single person, even a specter. Not without solid evidence. Boo the Council cannot take any official action here. That is why we created the specters. You have the authority to act as you see fit. If you truly believe Sovereign is the real threat, you must take whatever steps are necessary to stop it. And Saren. Good luck, Commander. From all of us. Uh, well, considering we're almost at the <laughs> three-hour mark here. Uh, well, no, we're not actually. We're at the two-and-a-half-hour mark. Uh, but I'm gonna split the videos in two halves. Anyway, two sets. Uh, let's just talk to everyone so that we'll fill the set up a bit. So, we'll... And 
I might be going to the Citadel next set. I don't know. Probably. Because we have some quests that we have to do. Okay, so that's where Caden used to be, and now it's empty. Sop, sop. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, you don't have anything to say. Yeah. Yes, Commander? Is there I some? should go. Goodbye, Commander. Liara? Commander, are you coming Is to check up on me? the same as last time? You look much better. How are you feeling? Dr. Chakwas assures me I am going to be fine. I was impressed with her knowledge of Asari physiology. You're in good hands. Dr. Chakwas knows what she's doing. This is the same as before. I've been thinking about Saren. I actually feel a little sorry for him now. Because he's a doctor. He's become a slave to the Reapers, and he can't even see it. He is trapped inside his own mind. Part of him senses his identity slowly being swallowed up by Sovereign, but he is powerless to stop it. I wonder how he first fell into Sovereign's trap. Did he think he could somehow stop the Reapers from returning? Or was he simply 